Hello and welcome to this Mindfulness in Nature video on behalf of the Stuart Low Trust. My name is Katie, thank you for joining me today. So today we are going to be talking about mindfulness obviously um, and how we can bring it into nature um, and how it, nature can help us to kind of reconnect with the present moment. So again mindfulness, um, in case you haven't watched the other videos, is um, basically being in the present moment without judgement. Um, and kind of being in nature can help us to use our senses to bring us back to the present moment and to enhance the present moment. Um, so last time we, we, we've been talking about water, last time we, we were talking about the kind of focusing on the smaller things like pebbles and kind of um, making those the centre of, of our awareness. Um, and today we're going to be talking about more about the earth um, and more about trees and also we're going to be doing a meditation on um, a conker um, and an acorn and maybe some leaves as well um, and yeah so just kind of reconnecting with with trees and the earth um, so co a conker obviously is, is, a, is the, the, the seed of the horse chestnut tree um, and you can see them quite a lot I think in, in parks and, and in London um, at, on certain streets if you live in a very leafy street um, if you're lucky enough to have a horse chestnut in your road um, then around this time of year in um, sort of September time you will see a lot of conkers on the ground and the, the, the conker will emerge from the, the, the case um, normally when they hit the ground and that's how they're designed to kind of then um, reproduce um, and also the acorn obviously is the, is the seed of the uh, oak tree and um, one of the ways that, that the oak tree reproduces is, is to rely on squirrels and other animals to actually um, plant their seeds for them because squirrels will eat quite a lot of acorns but they'll also bury them for winter and then forget where they've hidden them um, which means then a, a, a new oak can grow where they've, where they've buried them and this is just one of the ways that nature is, is, is so connected um, uh, that you know we are kind of we rely on animals we rely on on plants and, and we're all kind of part of the, the same ecosystem and it can be easy to forget that I think sometimes living in a city we feel quite disconnected um, in living in a building and we, we kind of forget that actually we are part of nature part of the world around us um, so yes I think we, we I would in, encourage you to kind of reconnect with nature in whichever way you um, you can and one of those ways could be to kind of collect some leaves, collect conkers, um, collect acorns, um, whatever um, you see that, that kind of um, that attracts you um, and you can kind of take those home and actually meditate with them uh, and appreciate them because when we, we start to notice things, these things we start to appreciate them more um, when we start to feel that, that kind of reconnection um, and it's very important because obviously um, we need to sustain the, ro the world around us um, and that's something that um, you know has been, <laughs> been quite tricky um, over the last um, few decades so it's very important um, so yes thank you for watching today I'm, I'm going to be doing the meditation shortly um, and I would just a reminder to subscribe to the Stuart Low Trust YouTube channel uh, and to my YouTube channel and also to check out the Stuart Low Trust website slt.org.uk you'll find all the latest news on how we are um, connecting with people and um, reducing isolation and enhancing people's well-being um, so thank you once again for joining me today I hope to see you in the next video enjoy the meditation So just gazing at this conquer on the screen. Looking at the case, shell. The shape of it. The colour. 
different colours. The texture. Noticing what you notice about this conquer. And just noticing the inside of the conquer shell. Imagine the softness inside. Noticing where the conquer attaches to the case, to the shell, and how it's grown. Beginning to notice the colour of the conquer. Once again, just noticing the inside, the shell, the colour and the texture. And how the conquer sits perfectly, snugly, inside its shell. And maybe taking a moment to appreciate the tree that this conquer fell from. That may have been there for many, many years. And the uniqueness of that tree and this conquer. Noticing the light shining on the surface of the conquer. Different colours or shades or marks.
And then bringing your awareness to this acorn and leaves from an oak tree. sound of the leaves the base of the acorn the texture of it and the acorn itself the smoothness the shape of it and anything else you notice And bringing your awareness to this leaf in this moment. Noticing the shape. The texture. The patterns. The colours, appreciating the tree that it came from. and its uniqueness Noticing the difference in the texture of the back of the leaf. Difference in colours.
and noticing this leaf. The difference in shape and colour and texture. Noticing any thoughts or judgments you make about the leaves. Just as best you can, giving your full attention to this leaf, this moment. And its uniqueness. And just bringing your awareness to this leaf. Once again, noticing the shape. The colours. the textures, and the patterns that make this leaf unique. And just continuing to gaze at this leaf, the back of the leaf, the difference in colours, and anything else you notice. I'm just appreciating all three leaves and this moment. 